I didn't watch. I saw a clip of Young Miami, I guess, on the new Merge Blige show, The Wine and Dine on BET. Now, Young Miami is 29. They say she's 29. We, a lot of times you don't know how old entertainers is. Trust me on that. But she's she's being interviewed by Mary J. Blige. Taraji P. Henson is there also. And, you know, she's asking about they boo thing. Mary J. Blige is 52 years old. 52 years old. And she explains how she is now dating herself. And she takes herself out on dates. And Taraji P. Henson, at 52 years old, also, yeah, Mary, 29, Mary J., 52, Taraji, 52. When Mary J. Bias says, she takes herself out on dates. Taraji, who just went to go find herself, said it is powerful to basically be by yourself, to be a millionaire, to be a totally successful woman, a career-driven woman, and at 52 years old, take your own self out on your yeah, on dates. And it made me think. I was like, okay, I, I think I get it. It might be obvious, but... A woman's independence equals no cooperation, no compromise, and equals no man. And it made me think, why do older women give younger women the type of advice that will leave them all alone? Because in the end, what women teach other women is to not cooperate. But they teach them to manipulate, to get what they want. And it seems like the only thing, they don't even want their own love. They don't want to be cherished. They don't, they don't want to be. They don't want to be worshipped. Not really. They, they just want money. They just want things. But they're the most emotional creatures that walk the earth. But their feelings is only for themselves and for women, not for men. It's a damn shame.